Sup my dudes, Valk here. Today, Doma got a massive buff. He did. They buffed his ability so it works better. They buffed the cooldown so you don't really need to bring more than one female to the team. And we're going to kind of see exactly how crazy we can send it. So what we're going to do with this team is we're about to run into random unit. We're going to swap this out for investigator. And we're going to need a lot of money because I just kind of want to see exactly how far we can push it. How far we can make his attack stat go and see how crazy we can get it. So for that, we're also going to need to take Makima here. And we're going to have to put Makima in her OG form. We're going to have to put her in form 1 because she can get a much higher attack stat then. So we're going to put Makima in form 1. And we're going to run triple money units. And we're going to have some crazy income. So now we're going to go over to Endless Mode. We're going to go to Endless Snow Hill. And we're going to run it on normal and just see how big the doma buff is because you guys before like saw last time i did it i could only really cap out around like three mil roughly is where i was getting um it was really hard to go past three mil so i'm really curious to see exactly how far i can go with this ah good sweet coffee sweet sweet nectar <laughs> anyways um i'm really curious to see how far we can go using the new doma and seeing how far we can do pretty much anything with them. All right, now that we're in, I'm going to go ahead, hit it to three times speed. We're going to put Doma down all the way in the back here. Um, actually, I probably don't want to put him there, do I? I probably want to put him like around here ish. Yeah, because we're only really going to work on this one Doma. Alright, so then we're going to put an Oshino down here. And we're going to hit auto skip and ready up. And now we're going to put down our dingies right here as well. And the reason we're putting stuff down so far back is because we kind of want to just buy time. Uh, we kind of just want to give enough time to really get everything up and running and ramping up. Um, we don't have any fly units yet, so we should be good just to, like, pull send this for now. Uh, let's go ahead and put down our Kinjaku Demon. That'll be nice and helpful. Um, up the range. Okay. So far, so good. So we're just working mostly on just money now. And then we're gonna up our Aishino. Hit, uh, her auto ability there amp her up and they're starting to leak by a little bit so i think now i'm finally going to upgrade doma uh let's go ahead let's upgrade him we're just going to keep doma nice and healthy nice and upgraded and now that he's got his full cone we're going to full send to aishino and then from a full send to aishino we're going to start upgrading investigator you're going to be like valk why do you need this much money why do you need all this money just to test and see how good the buff is for him? Uh, you're going to find out here in a minute. So next we're going to do this. All right, we're going to make sure to max him out. And then we're going to max out our Doma. And now we put down our Maki. So this Maki has Hunter passive. So realistically, you could write out Hunter passive, right? And just let that go and be its thing. Uh, but that's not what we're going to do here. We're going to full send this. We're going to see uh, how high we can get her attack. You can see we currently have her at 2 million attack. Uh, we do want to get all the way up to this upgrade here because we're not spending the 600k to get the last upgrade. So now she has 2.8 million HP or 2.8 million attack. We're going to feed in a Doma. You can see Doma's at 1.26 mil already. So now we're going to upgrade this. We're going to get that maxed out right away and then we're going to do it again. And you guys can see also they shorten the cooldown of it from 300 to 100 so it's much easier now to actually be able to just turbo pump him full of uh money just like this turbo pump him full of attack stat so we're able to take this makima and just full send on him and he's going to be able to eat here again in a second he's going to feast feast my boy feast all right so we eat again went up 300k off that one pretty good pretty good and we're just going to keep doing this over and over and over. And this is kind of how it goes. We get her up. We do this. And we just kind of do this until we run out, essentially. Um, and you're, like, this is why I brought all these money units. Because, look, even with all these money units, right, 
even with all these money units, um, I'm still not like, I'm still not in the positive. Like, there's no way I can actually make enough money to offset how much, or uh, how much it costs to do this. So we're just gonna keep pumping. Like normally, it goes a little bit faster because we have multiple females we're feeding into them, but we're just feeding the one. And you guys can see it's going pretty good actually. Okay, so I love the one time I realized now I didn't actually buff him up with our buff the Makima up with Oshi and he scales off the attack stat itself. So not kind of missing that buff up is kind of a big deal. All right, so he's at 3 million right now and we're only on wave 41. So you guys can see how fast he can ramp up. It's actually pretty quick. Uh, like I said, he's a pretty solid unit now. So we can go ahead and feed up again. Do this. And then we're going to auto ability. Do this. If we ever get enough money, we can get that final upgrade and feed. This is why we brought this Makima instead of the other one. Because her attack stack can just go so high. You can just permanently feed her. Whoever left this in the comment suggestion was actually a really good idea. And I'm glad I listened to it. Because this is just a super solid idea all in all. And I'm really happy with it. Alright, so let's... um. While well, waiting on this one actually here this next one whenever we get this done i'm gonna put another oshi down max it out Got another makima all right we're gonna kind of spread some stuff out now just to kind of like delay them a good little bit so we're gonna set you to last we're gonna put another kujaku demon down right here and we're gonna put another kujaku demon down right here and we're going to put down another one here another doma we're going to increase range and we'll set him to last as well all right so now with this one you're the wrong one we eat and then we put down another oshi auto ability up and then another makima and we kind of just keep full sending this just keep full sending all the damage. I think everything's down at max. Yeah, everything's down at max. So now this, we have 30 more seconds, so we can start building up our money. And we're good to go. We're just kind of big chilling. Everybody's maxed out, right? Yeah. And like I said, even with like three money units on the team, you can still see where the amount of money this, this takes is just a ton. The amount of money it takes is crazy. He's at a 4 million attack stat now, basically eating only Makima. So, never mind, he's at a 7 million attack stat. Okay, that was before Oshi buff hit, and now the Oshi buffs hit. So, I wonder if we can get him past 10 mil. I want to see, like, how viable this is in, like, the long run type of thing. Um, Probably if I brought more females instead of more money, but then again, we still can't get that last Makima upgrade, so... Uh, 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 all right, up this, and then once that Oshi buff hits, we'll be able to see exactly how impactful it is. Eight million attack stat, dude. This Doma buff went crazy. This with freeze too is mate is he's such a menace in terms of damage now. Like he's such a menace. He's so damn good now. Doma genuinely might be one of the best units in the game. And I'm not exaggerating when I say that. I feel like I'm not exaggerating, at least. Uh, he just is so strong now. It's crazy to me how strong he is. Alright, so let's go ahead. Let's max out Oshi before we pop our buff this time. So we get the maxed out buff. Alright. So now that's done. Now we just kind of wait to be able to do it again. And we just keep full sending on this one. We got him at 9.43 million right now attack stat. And that with Freeze 2 is crazy. Freeze 2 is such a strong passive. So that 9.43 million attack stat with Freeze 2 is just wacky, dude. It's so wacky. Okay, we feed again. Oh, I probably should have waited to activate that. Eh, it's whatever. It don't matter. I mean, it does, but it don't. But it do, but it don't. All right. Amp up again. We wait for that that Oshi buff to hit. It's gonna hit here in a second. Never mind. It hit auto ability. Now it'll hit. Ten point six million. 
Holy! Oh, he's cooking, dude. He is so cooking. Alright. Uh, we could almost get the last Machma upgrade. Do I? Dare I? I kind of want it, I'm not gonna lie. Alright. 45 million attack. How much is this gonna feed into? 20 million?! Oh, hell no! <laughs> what have I done?! 20 million attack! Oh, hell no! Anyways, we do it again. 21.28 <laughs> million, and we're not done yet. We're gonna keep taking him up. We're gonna keep running. We're just gonna keep picking range, because he doesn't need attack, because we can just keep buffing his attack. This good old-fashioned way that we're doing it. Um, so we're gonna do that now. And now we're gonna max this out. Auto ability. Bring out the Makima. 22 million. Holy. That's just crazy amount of attack. Especially, like I said, the reason it's so crazy is freeze you in the way it works. You guys can see how much HP do they have. They have 612 million HP, and he's just going to absolutely watch when they watch when they unfreeze. I'm gonna just plop when they unfreeze. Yeah, that's just incredible amount of HP. All right, so now we're going to level this up. We're going to munch munch. Then we're going to activate this, max this out. Idle buff it up. And do this. What's his attack set out? 24 million attack. Woo! Woo! He a little strong, me thinks. Me thinks he's a little strong. Um, he's so good now. Oh yeah, he's so damn good. It's just crazy how strong he is now. Alright, so we do this. We're going to munch munch. Right? Much, much. Oh, lag. Activate this. Bring that all the way up. Turn this all the way up. Activate Death Shot. Might as well. Contribute to damage some. Uh, they're finally pushing past, so this could be the end of the run. But where's his attack stat now? 26 million! That's crazy! Um, that is so insane now. All right, all right, all right. Let me just, let me just, uh, real quick get a screenshot for the thumbnail, just in case that's what I want to use. That's so insane, dude. This, this buff they gave him is just wacky. It's such a strong buff. He's so good now. Like, he's so damn good now. Uh, uh, I don't like I want to push it but at the same time I don't so we're just going to put you on auto for a little bit so avert your eyes because we got to deal with the, the really annoying screen shake for a second I uh, have Makima continue to help out here just for a little bit 151 billion damage okay so there we go we do this max this out Auto ability. Makima. Alright. Did I not put on auto? I did. She just didn't get the buff yet. Alright, cool. So now we just continue eating. So... I'm at a 9 million score solo with him. He's so good. Oh, he's so good now. Mm, 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 mm. Max him. Auto ability. What's the Maki? Where's, where's he at now? Why is it only 12? Okay, there it is. 28.13 million. 
Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah, this one's doing numbers. This probably wasn't the best spot for because now when they push past, they're going to run into this. Uh, I'm pretty sure I want to actually get rid of these other domas. No, they're just stalling the ones in the back, right? Yeah, that's fine. As long as they keep stalling the ones in the back while well, this one focuses these. Because their freeze isn't doing any damage. Like, look at the difference in attack. 1.12 million, right? 28.13 million. Crazy. Crazy, crazy attack numbers. Um, I can only see, like, I'm curious to see how far we can push this. Because you can see we're still going to clear out this wave. Like, this wave's still going to get cleared out. I'm going to turn auto skip off now. Just because I, uh... I don't want to skip anymore. I'm just going to just slowly push on up now. And just see exactly how far I can go with this. Because I'm at a 10 million score solo right now, guys. Solo. 10 million score. And the only person doing anything is Dolma. This is a 10 million score on Dolma and Dolma alone. Dolma is insane now. Oh, man. Alright, so we're going to sell Oshi. We're gonna max out Oshi as soon as we get some money. Let's just go ahead and activate the buff now, just so Doma has some sort of a buff. 29.23 million without max Oshi buff. I'm pretty sure we broke 30 mil. Um, we're going to reach some crazy levels of damage soon. Yeah, absolutely. Absolutely gonna reach crazy levels of damage. I wonder how much money they're generating in total. It doesn't say. I wish it said, like, instead of total damage, total money. That'd be such a cool stat to see. Uh, just like in, just for comparison. All right, so he's at 29.23 million. Uh, we can turn auto skip on. Screw it. Let the auto, let it ring, dude. Let the auto skip go. So until too much enemy, we're gonna chill out. We're not gonna eat until it says too much enemy. Cause I wanna make sure I can maximize how much I get out of Oshi essentially. Uh, Cause we are at a point of min maxing. Like, absolutely at a point of min maxing. Mm -hmm. The only bad thing is, is running multiple domas is whenever these domas freeze these guys. Because then I can't get this doma to pop freeze here. This is why I said I think he should be like full AoE in one placement. Full AoE in one placement would be a little broken with how much he can scale up. 30.62 million. Holy. Okay, so now that we have too much enemy, uh, we're going to go ahead and do this. I'm going to turn an Oshi. Max out an Oshi. Idle buff on. That way he can get cranked. Uh, he's at 32 million right now. Alright. I wish we could get him up to another, like, another 600, like, get the 600k again. But realistically, you're not going to get that multiple times in a run. Uh, it just gets to a point where you start slowing down too much. Yeah, no, this is so wacky. How strong he is. He's just, he's so strong it's comedic. Alright, we're going to do this just so she can start helping. Uh, 460 million off a single hit. Kind of based. Kind of based. And we finally lost on an 11 million score with just Doma. I didn't come in here expecting to last that long. That's insane. I think he ended on like a 30 million attack stat. Like, dude, it was like 32 million or something like that. Dude, Doma's so good now. Oh, he was already really good before. Now he's just even better. Like, Doma, it like... He is such a strong leaderboard unit now because he not only is your stun, but you can only have really one person running Doma. You want one person running Doma and then other people running other stuff. Like, you definitely want to spread it out, especially with the new uh, Secret Rare Fallen Angel, which I'll be grinding later. Uh, they finally finished that. That character looks busted as all hell. I can't wait to try that out, especially with Himeno. Like, Himeno plus uh, Fallen Angel looks really crazy. Um, I can't wait to see that. But yeah. Anyways, that's basically the showcase. Let me know what you guys think in the comment section below. This buff was crazy. He's so good now. I'll catch you guys in the next one. Peace.